Hey yogis, uh, my name's Sophie. I haven't filmed a YouTube class in a while, so I thought I would give you guys a short energizing class today. So it'll be about 20 to 25 minutes. We'll move all around our mat and just build some heat and get moving in our body. So let yourself get started in a comfortable seat. And that can be sitting with whatever shin in front feels best for you, up on a block or a pillow if you need a little bit more space. And when you're ready, just let your hands rest down on your knees, start to soften your shoulders down on your back and close your eyes. And it might take a few breaths for you to arrive there. And as you let yourself close your eyes, can you soften? Right, relax your belly, let your knees hang from side to side as you press through the sides of your feet. Right, that little crinkle between your eyebrows disengage. Right, and then start to take a slightly deeper breath in through your nose. Exhale, side out through your mouth. One more like that, slow, big breath in. Exhale. And then seal your lips and just begin to breathe in through your nose and out through your nose. Okay, let your hands be soft on your lap. And as you sit here breathing, just start to check in with your body. chest and your shoulders slightly rise on the inhale and then as you exhale you most slight slightly slouch as you breathe out and then as you sit here beginning to connect with your breath and just let yourself get centered onto your mouth all right be in this space connecting to your breath and to your body nothing else to think about Can you slow down right for these next few breaths? All right, big breath in. Inhale, be slightly fuller. Exhale. Right, blink your eyes open and make your way onto your hands and your knees, coming into a table pose. Right, so arrive anywhere that feels right for you, whether it's just shifting forward or swinging your legs to one side. And when you arrive, spread your fingers out as wide as you can as you press through the tops of your feet. Right, there's already that slight engagement in your lower belly. And as you inhale, start to drop the belly down, lift your knees forward for a cow pose. And as you exhale, press through your hands, dome your upper back as your chin tucks in towards your chest. Just take five more rounds like that. Inhale, heart pulls forward and through as your belly drops down. Spread your sitting bones out wide. Exhale, press through your hands, round through your back. Four more at your pace. Inhale, you glide forward. If you want, you can take any other movement here, either sticking with the succinct cat cows on the inhale and the exhale. Maybe you take some barrel rolls or hip sways. Let yourself find that moment of flow. All right, as you move through your cat-cow, can you dome through your upper back even more as you round? And as you inhale, can you feel that broadening through your collarbones as you press through your big toes? All right, three more rounds. All right, moving at your pace. Eyes can be closed here if you want, really feeling into your breath, into your body. Let whatever round you're in be your last. And then slowly make your way back to a neutral table pose. Press firmly through your hands, your shoulders lift up towards the sky. Extend that right leg back long behind you, flex your right foot, and start to turn your gaze over towards the left as you step your right foot outside your left leg, toes tucked, and just start to pulse forward and back. All right, as you pulse forward and back, you're lifting up onto your right big toe, and as you shift back, extend out through that right heel. You're turning your gaze over towards the left so you feel a side body stretch on your right side. Right, there's that slight pinch in your fingers. 
Big breath in and breath out. Slowly let yourself find stillness. Right foot lifts off the floor. Frog your right knee out towards the side like a half frog and flex your right foot. Hug your left hip in towards your midline as you start to take some circles with that right leg. Right, so just moving out through some hip mobility here, moving into whatever size circles feels best for you. Take those circles in the opposite direction. All right, one more circle. The next time your right knee hugs in towards your nose, hug it in even more as you point through your right foot. Inhale, right leg extends back behind you, cow to your spine, look forward. Three more, exhale, right knee hugs in towards your nose. Last two, inhale, right leg reaches back and away, cow to your spine, exhale, hug it in. One more, inhale, reach back and away, exhale, right knee hugs in. Inhale, right leg reaches long, lift your head and heart up towards the sky, take a breath, exhale, right knee hugs in towards your nose, pause. You'll cross your right knee in front of your left, taking a cross-legged stance, Separate your legs out a little bit wider as you walk your hands forward, tented fingers start to send your hips back in space for a cross-legged child's pose. If it's too much to send your hips back, you might just be in this cross-legged table pose, shifting forward and back. Right now, as you let your hips shift back behind you, shoulders reach back behind you, squeeze your inner thighs together, let your belly rest on top of your thighs, and let your forehead just hang in empty space. Right, big breath in, and big breath out. Two more, big breath in through your nose. Exhale. Last one, breath in, be wherever you are, and breath out. Slowly begin to shift yourself back forward. You'll just uncross your right leg and meet yourself back into a table pose. Readjust your hands and your feet. One round of cat cow, inhale, belly drops down, gaze lifts forward. Exhale, press through your hands, dome through your upper back. Slowly begin to make your way back to that neutral table pose, slight tuck to your chin. Extend that left leg back long behind you, start to turn your gaze over to the right as you step your left foot outside your right leg. Left toes tuck, start to pulse forward and back. Right, and as your gaze looks over to the right, you've got that side body stretch on the left side of your body, think a C curve. Right, and as you pulse forward and back, feel the stretch in your wrists as well as the back of your left leg. Right, big breath in. And big breath out. Slowly let yourself find stillness. Left foot lifts off the floor. Frog that left knee out towards the side as you flex your left foot. Wrap your left right hip in towards your midline and start to take some circles with that left leg. All right, beginning to notice the differences on each side of the body. Moving in the space and mobility that you have here. Take those circles in the opposite direction. One more circle, let that left knee hug in towards your nose, lift your shoulders up towards the sky. Inhale, left leg extends long, cow to your spine, look forward. Three more, exhale, left knee hugs in towards your nose. Inhale, reach back and away, cow to your heart. Exhale, left knee hugs in. Last one, inhale, reach. Exhale, hug it in. Inhale, left leg reaches back behind you, take a breath in through your nose. Exhale, left knee hugs and pause. Cross your left knee in front of your right, coming into that cross-legged stance as you separate your legs. Start to walk your hands forward, tend to fingers, and this is my where, maybe where you stay, and you just pulse forward and back. If you want a little bit more, you can take that cross-legged child pose and start to shift your hips back in space as you squeeze your inner thighs together. Belly rests on top of your left thigh, crawl your hands a little further forward, and let your head release down into empty space. Press through the sides of your legs, Big breath in and breath out. All right, just two more. Breath in through your nose. Breath out. Last one. Big breath in and out. Slowly plant your palms. Shift yourself back forward. Uncross that left leg back in your table pose. Last round of cow cat. Inhale, pull your heart forward and through. Exhale, press through your big toes as you round through your belly. Slowly pull your heart forward and through cow pose, tuck your toes, start to lift your knees and hips up and back, downward facing dog, and just start to paddle out your legs. All right, shift from one side to the other as you wrap your inner arms in and relax your head down towards the floor. All right, big breath in through your nose. Exhale, side out through your mouth. 
Next inhale, that left leg lifts high to the sky. Point through your left toes as you square that left hip down. Take a breath in. And as you exhale, hit that left knee in toward your nose. Step your left foot forward in front of you. Tented fingers spraying your left foot. Square that left hip back. Lunge forward. Runners lunge. Take a breath. Exhale, right knee drops down. Untuck your right toes. Two arms lift, low lunge. Square that left hip back behind you as you soften your shoulders down. Right there's that slight stretch in the top of your right thigh. Take a breath. Exhale, left hand grab your right wrist, extend through your right side as you side bend over to the left. Feel that reach and extension through the right side of your body as you tug that right wrist even more. Inhale, arms lift up back toward the sky. Exhale, cactus your arms from side to side, sternum lifts up, take a breath. Release your hands to interlace your fingers behind your lower back. Make a fist with your hands and roll your shoulders down and back as you pull your fist to the back of your right thigh. Sternum lifts up towards the sky, take an inhale. And as you exhale, hover your belly forward. Start to tuck your right toes, lift your right knee off the floor like you're about to pound yourself forward. Feel the power and engagement of your legs as your fists reach back behind you. Take a breath in. Exhale, release your hands. Right hand drops down towards the floor as the left arm peels up, open twist. Lift your gaze up towards your left big thumb. Take a breath in. Exhale, left arm reaches forward and crawl down the right side of your mat. Wide-legged forward fold, head and upper body release down. And as you let yourself arrive here, maybe you're bending from one knee to the other, or just taking a moment of stillness. All right, big breath in, and breath out. Inhale, lift up halfway, get long. Slowly start to walk yourself to the back of the mat. Right toes pivot forward, you're on the ball mound of your left foot. Tend with fingers, or maybe you have blocks under your hands. Lunge into your right knee, look forward, think of cow pose. Exhale, hips pull back, straight-ish with your leg. Pyramid pose, maybe you bend your back knee. Two more like that. Inhale, you pulse forward, breath in. Exhale, hips pull back in space. One more, inhale, you glide forward, take a breath in. And as you exhale, hips pull back in space, pause. Press through all 10 fingers, halfway lift, get long. And as you exhale, fold in, pause, three breaths. You want a little bit more, you can lift your right toes off the floor and flex your right toes toward your nose. That right hip is squaring back behind you, take a breath in and a breath out. Last one, big breath in and out. Inhale, start to shift back forward, right foot plants down. You'll step your left foot forward to meet your right forward fold, reach your heart forward, and then let yourself fold down. Micro bend in your knees, breath in and out. Inhale, halfway lift, get long. Exhale, fold. Slowly take your time, stacking shoulders over your hips. Two arms lift up towards the sky. Your right hand will grab your left wrist. Inhale, extend through left side as you side bend over to the right. Add more weight to your left foot. Inhale, arms lift up back towards the sky. Exhale, cactus your arms from side to side as your sternum lifts up towards the sky. Release your hands to interlace your fingers behind your lower back. Shoulders roll back and down, head and heart peel up towards the sky. And as you exhale, bend your knees, hinge at your hips, forward fold. Micro bend in your elbows, you're not hyperextending out through your arms. Maybe you're swaying your head and upper body from side to side. All right, big breath in and out. Last one, breath in. Exhale, slowly release two hands down towards the floor. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Bend your knees to plant your hands. Step, step, both feet back, high plank. Knees can be up or knees can be down. Go with the option that feels right for you. Back to the thighs are lifting up towards the sky as you wrap your triceps forward like you're pivoting the mat underneath your hands. Take a big breath. And as you exhale, slowly lower all the way down onto your belly. Untuck your toes, tent your fingers off the sides of your mat, elbows are wide. Inhale, head and heart, peel off the floor, feel the broadening in your collarbones. And as you exhale, dip your right shoulder in toward your midline as your gaze looks left. Inhale, press to your fingertips, lift back through center. Exhale, left shoulder dips in, gaze looks right. Inhale, lift up, take a big breath in, press to your big toes. And as you exhale, lower down. Your hands will move back to frame your lower ribs, squeeze your elbows in. Start to tuck your toes, knees and thighs, lift off the floor, take a breath. And as you exhale, make your way up and back to downward facing dog. That can either be pressing through a plank, a table pose, or always shifting back to a child's pose and then lifting up and back. 
All right, when you get there, take a breath in. Exhale, sigh it out. Inhale, right leg lifts high to the sky. Exhale, right knee hugs in towards your nose. Step your right foot forward. Tended fingers frame your right foot, runner's lunge, look forward. Exhale, left knee drops down. Untuck your left toes, two arms lift, low lunge. Square that right hip back behind you as you press your left big toe. Your palms begin to face each other as you soften your shoulders down. Take a breath. Exhale, right hand grabs your left wrist, extend and side bend over to the right. Tug your left wrist even more and maybe your head is relaxing into your right upper arm. Inhale, arms lift up back towards the sky. Exhale, cactus your arms from side to side. Release your hands, interlace your fingers behind your lower back. Shoulders roll back and down, lift your heart up. Exhale, hinge yourself forward as you tuck your left toes and lift your left knee off the floor. Reach your shoulders back behind you, take a big breath in. Exhale, left hand releases down as your right arm peels up, open twist, lift your gaze up towards your right thumb. Square that right hip back behind you, take an inhale. Exhale, right arm reaches forward, so to crawl yourself down the left side of your mat, wide-legged forward fold, head and upper body hang heavy. Take a few breaths to find whatever little movement you want here. You can be bending from one knee to the other, just swaying your head from side to side. Big breath in and big breath out. Inhale, halfway lift. Fingertips on the floor, so to pivot yourself towards the front of the mat, left toes forward, ball mount of your right foot. Tented fingers, lunge yourself forward. Exhale, hips pull back, straight-ish with your leg. Maybe you bend your back knee. Two more, inhale, you pulse forward, breath in. Exhale, hips pull back. One more, inhale, you pull forward, runner's lunge, think of cow pose. Exhale, hips pull back in space, pause. Press your fingertips, halfway lift, get long. Exhale, fold forward, maybe your left toes lift off the floor. Press into that left heel if you're taking that option. Take a breath in and a big breath out. Two more big breath in and breath out. All right, inhale, pull yourself forward. Look forward as your right foot steps forward to meet your left and fold yourself down. Inhale, halfway lift, get long. Exhale, fold. Slowly begin to roll yourself all the way up. Two arms lift up towards the sky. Left hand grabs your right wrist, extend and side bend over to the left. Add more weight to your right foot, micro bend in your knees. Inhale, arms lift up back towards the sky. Exhale, goal post your arms from left to right. Sternum lifts up. Release your hands down, interlace your fingers behind your lower back. Shoulder roll back and down, head and heart peel up. Exhale, bend your knees, hinge out your hips, forward fold with a shoulder stretch, micro bend in your elbows. Take a big breath in and a breath out. One more breath in. Exhale, release two hands down towards the floor. Inhale, lift up halfway. Exhale, fold. Bend your knees to plant your hands. Step, step, both feet back, high plank. Knees can be up or knees can be down. Lift the backs of your thighs up towards the sky. Crown of the head is reaching forward. Take a breath. Exhale, slowly lower down. Untuck your toes, tented fingers. Inhale, head and heart peel off the floor. Exhale, left shoulder dips in, gaze looks right. Press through all 10 fingers, lift up through center. Exhale, right shoulder dips in. Inhale, lift up, get a little bit wider. And as you exhale, lower down. Hands move back to frame your lower ribs, squeeze your elbows in, take a breath. And as you exhale, make your way up and back to downward facing dog. We're right, going to move through that same sequence a little bit quicker, connecting to breath and movement. Take a breath in. Exhale, sigh it out. Inhale, left leg lifts high. Exhale, left knee hugs in. Step your left foot forward. Right knee drops down. Untuck your right toes. Two arms lift. Low lunge. Big breath in. Exhale, left hand up. Grab your right wrist. Extend and side bend over to the left. Inhale, two arms lift high. Exhale, goal push your arms from side to side. Interlace your fingers behind your lower back. Shoulders roll back and down, head and heart lift. Exhale, hinge forward, tuck your right toes. Lift your right knee off the floor. Take a breath. Exhale, right hand releases down. Left arm peels up, open twist. Big inhale. Exhale, left arm reaches forward. Pivot yourself to the right side of your mat. Wide-legged forward folds. 
Inhale, lift up halfway, pivot yourself to the back of your mat, tended fingers, runners lunge, look forward. Exhale, hips pull back. One more like that, inhale, you glide forward, breath in. Exhale, hips pull back and space pause, maybe your right toes lift off the floor. Big breath in and down. Inhale, you glide forward, left foot steps forward to meet your right forward folds. Inhale, slowly roll yourself all the way up. Two arms lift up towards the sky, right hand grabs your left wrist, extend, side bend over to the right. Inhale, center, exhale, cactus your arms, sternum lifts up as you interlace your fingers behind your lower back, pull your fist down towards the earth, hinge at your hips, forward folds. Take a breath, exhale, two hands release down towards the floor. Inhale, lift up halfway, get long, exhale, folds. Bend your knees, plant your hands, step, step, both feet back, high plank. Extend out through your heels, take a breath, exhale, lower down. Untuck your toes, tented fingers, inhale, head and heart, peel up towards the sky. Exhale, right shoulder dips in, gaze looks left. Inhale, center, exhale, left shoulder dips in. Inhale, center, take an inhale. And as you exhale, lower down. Hands move back to frame your lower ribs. Take a breath. And as you exhale, make your way up and back to downward facing dog. What does your body need? Take a big breath in. Exhale, side out. Last round of flow. Inhale, right leg lifts high. Exhale, right knee hugs in. Step your right foot forward. Left knee drops down. Untuck your left toes. Two arms lift, low lunge. Take a breath. Exhale, right hand, grab your left wrist, extend, side bend over to the right. Inhale, center, exhale, cactus your arms from left to right. Hands lower down, interlace your fingers, pull your fist to the back of your left thigh. Exhale, hover your chest forward, left knee lifts off the floor, pull your shoulders back and down. Take a breath. Exhale, left hand releases down, right arm peels up, open twist. Big breath in. Exhale, right arm reaches forward, pivot yourself down the left side of your mat, wide-legged forward fold. Inhale, halfway left, pivot yourself forward, left toes turn forward, runners lunge, look forward. Exhale, hips pull back, straight-ish with your legs. One more, inhale, you glide forward. Exhale, hips pull back, pause, maybe your left toes lift off the floor. One breath in here, and out. Inhale, glide forward, right foot steps forward to meet your left forward folds. Inhale, slowly roll yourself all the way up. Two arms lift up towards the sky, your left hand grabs your right wrist, extend, side bend over to the left. Inhale, center, exhale, cactus your arms, hands interlaced behind your lower back, shoulders back and down. Exhale, forward fold with the shoulder stretch. Big breath in. Exhale, hands release down towards the floor. Inhale, halfway lift, get long. Exhale, fold. Bend your knees to plant your hands, step, step, both feet back, high plank, last time we're here. Hug your lower belly in, big breath, exhale, lower down. Untuck your toes, tented fingers, inhale, head and heart, peel up. Exhale, left shoulder dips in, gaze looks right. Inhale, center, exhale, right shoulder dips in. Inhale, lift up, get a little bit wider, and as you exhale, lower down. Your hands move back to frame your lower ribs, take a breath, and as you exhale, press your hips back towards your heels, child's pose. Soften your forehead down towards the earth, and if it doesn't quite reach top, doesn't quite touch, you can always stack your palms or your fists, let your head rest on top of your hands. So your hip flexors begin to soften and let your shoulders relax. All right, big breath in, and breath out. One more, breath in and out. Next inhale, roll yourself up to a seat on your shin, just so you can swing your legs to either your right or your left side. You'll most likely want to scoot yourself forward so you have the space behind you to roll down onto your back. With your knees hugged in, just start to rock yourself from side to side. Okay, both hands will grab your right knee, extend your left leg long in front of you, let your left leg get heavy. Take a breath, and as you exhale, cross that right knee over to the left as your gaze rolls open to the right for a spinal twist. Let that right shoulder be soft. If you want, you can start to close your eyes. All right, big breath in and out. 
slowly roll yourself down. Left knee hugs in towards your chest to meet your right switch sides. Right leg goes long, both hands grab your left knee, take a breath. Exhale, left knee crosses over to the right as you turn your gaze over to the left. Big breath in and big breath out. Soften that right knee, breath in and out. Slowly begin to roll yourself down and extend that left leg long to meet your right, setting up for your Shavasana. All right, if there's any other pose that your body wants to take, let yourself take it. All right, and as you let yourself arrive into your final rest, right, take as long as you need here. Right, that can be anywhere from five breaths to 20 breaths. Right, but no, even though that it was a short practice, still allowing yourself to arrive and disengage. Right, what makes yoga different than just a fitness class is the beginning and the end, and in the middle of integration. Right, that moment of checking in, that moment of clarity to be, okay, I'm here with my breath, and I'm here in my body. Right, so take as long as you need in this shape for Shavasana, let yourself settle and arrive. Right, thank you so much. I'll leave you guys here. My name is Sophie, and I'll see you guys again very soon. Namaste.